Hello. Oops, I know it's a bit rig it out there. Hi. Um, I'm not gonna show my face today because I don't look presentable, but this is all my lipstick as far as I could collect them all. Um so yeah, I am going to declutter them before I go to holidays. So bear with me and let's start, I guess. Um, my, by the way, my name is Mary. Mary's here. <laughs> Hi. I hope you like the video and if you like to stay for more to see, then subscribe and like too. Alright, thanks. Oops, sorry about the unstable, unstable, stable. <laughs> Right, I'm just gonna get a So I'm gonna put here everything that I won't be using. Everything that I'm going to declutter. Well, when I say decluttered, it means I'm giving them to friends and family. Mostly friends, I guess. Um, or family if they want any of my this lipstick that would be great so yeah let's start people so I'm just gonna put it here and then the one that I'd like to keep I'll just leave them here in the box I know it looks cluttered so I'm just gonna remove others first while well, dealing these thingy one by one maybe that wouldn't be looking like oh sorry a disaster all right <clears throat> i guess these two are not too much <laughs> oh, not too much on the table, I guess. Um, yeah, let's begin. I'm gonna put it the other side in here. Let's do the non cape, and I'll just put them back on their storage if I want to keep them. So let's start on this on this color pop. Majority of my lipstick. Is color pop, I guess, and secondly, is MAC, and the rest are just miscellaneous stuff from other places. I'm sorry about the noise, I think I should close the window to maximize the noise outside. Oh my god, I'm so unready, so unready with this thing. Can't even reach it. Thanks. <sighs> you guys, this is a disaster. Just kill this. There you go. There you go. Back to position. Oh, better. Better, better, better. Okay, let's start. I hope I'm close enough for you to see these things. Alright, starting off. Um, I think I've already decided. Because this that I put in this rubber band, it's already decided that I'm not keeping it. And these are my keeps, so... Looking right now, they're like half and half. But I'm still gonna give you swatches, so can see what they look like I'm gonna go swatches on the one that I'm not keeping so this one is in the shade I like it it's their cream finish stick I don't know so I'm giving you the swatch All right that's the shade uh, it doesn't it doesn't look great on my lips that's why 
I am decluttering them or somehow they are not the shade that I like to keep oh sorry about my swatches so that one is Kami right next one is Aquarius by the way I am Aquarius but the shade is not good for my lips it looks really really pale on my lips so there's no point wearing this guy here absolutely I'm so sorry am I too far in the camera I know I am trying to get closer to Taurus <laughs> this place is making so much noise alright so that's the one it's very it's a yellow brown I don't know why I didn't like that looks pretty hmm. maybe that's a maybe we'll put that on the side this one is gold digger Oof. you can see it that is gold digger done there. it's pretty for some people but not to me last one girl gun that looks pretty too hmm sorry about my swatches Ooh, that's so pretty. Why am I decluttering that? Alright. I'm a very brown color girl lipstick, so. Might as well put that in the maybe pile. Maybe pile, maybe pile. Put it out the box. So this here is decluttered. So, so far we decluttered four. And these five here are my capes. I'm going to give you a swatch. From them, so this is Brink. Can you see it closely? That is Brink. Ah. I'm just gonna open them all up so I could avoid the noise because this part here is very noisy. Okay, so first shade is Psych. It's a keep. Next shade is Capiche. It's a keep. Then one my favorite one is in the shade Ink Blood. It's a keep down there. Next one is Ziggy. It's a key too. Ooh, very pretty brown. Okay, we're keeping them. So, down row is decluttered. And this one, up row, is keep. But this two brown down here is a maybe. So, um, this is not a final declutter, to be honest. Um, maybe next year I would do another declutter again. I'm just trying to make room for new things that I will enjoy more and discover because this is a never-ending cycle of discovering new colors, discovering new shade that would work for my skin tone. So, yeah it's but like i'm gonna show you later because in my lipstick collection i've always decluttered them so if i receive not receive if i bought something and then i swatch them and i don't like them that like i literally don't like them at all they go straight to my donation box or my giveaway box for family and friends i'm gonna show you that because I know this looks so overwhelming and a lot for a person like me that, you know, just an average one. But I always declutter every now and then. 
this one is one of the declutter that I decided to record you know make a video with so yeah so we decluttered four of that this is keep and this two is a maybe enough ex rumbling or <laughs> explaining things anyway so I think we should start from this one down here because it is out of the way anyway this one is from Kiko Milano it's the lip oil oh lip nourishing lip oil it has a it has an orange thingy what do you call it essence or oh. yeah but it has some orange this I as you can see it's already down low and it's I had one buck up there it's a limited edition but I love this so much it's like a staple for me but it's really sad that it is not regular but so far I'm enjoying it while I can still have it so that's a keep this one is from L'Oreal Paris I'm, I'll try not to talk too much because we are already in 11 minutes Gosh. so this is in the shade I explore yep very pretty shade but I don't like the opacity of that lipstick on my lips so I use it as a blush and it works so I'm keeping that one this one is from L'Oreal I think yeah lip paint matte in the shade nude on fleek it is so pretty sorry it is so pretty as you can see but it's very light on me it's one of my oldest one to be honest and I don't use it so that's gonna go I tried to use it on my cheeks you know trying to be innovative but it's just doesn't this one is in the shade ginger balm from L'Oreal again it's a pretty golden brown as you can see it doesn't look right on my lips but I guess if I mix it with other lipstick it will be bomb because a good formula so I'll keep it for now it's fairly new in my collection and I paid full price for it for my hard work own money so you know I'll s n maybe on the next day later I'll be gone so this one is some of my lip care this is from Vaseline lip therapy SPF 15 I like this because it has no color so that can stay this one from Dr. Pow Pow Tinted Peach Pink Balm I don't like this one because I don't know it just leave it's weird can you see that it's a weird I don't like it on my lips it doesn't feel moisturizing at all and it's so thick and it has this white cast maybe because my lips is has a hyperpigmentation black hyperpigmentation not black but dark hyperpigmentation and it does not suit me at all so that's gonna go but that could use be in many things I might give this to my husband because on winter time he can use it this one is from Kiko on my on the green me collection in shade number five I did use it the other day but I I never wear what do you call it I never lip line I never wear lip liners so bomb no this one is from Anastasia can you use oh my swatches are out of the place oh, one it's pretty but it it does not stay to its true color it goes darker as it dries so I'm in offense and I, oh, it's expensive as well and I don't know what I'm gonna do with it but I'll keep it for now try to make it work and if not then it has to go on the next declutter maybe next next year on the next declutter who knows right so we've decluttered these so I keep two 
I'm gonna declutter this tree. Um, so I can put it aside out the way. And now we're gonna go through this color pop. <laughs> alright, alright, okay, we'll start with this. Okay, I think I did the same. This on this three rubber band, it's already been decided that it's gonna go, so I'm gonna give you a swatch. I don't wear this shade at all. I am not that. Look, it's never been wear. It's fairly new. It's the first swatch. This is like. I didn't choose this color. This is um, a gift from Colourpop because. I don't know. I think they got delayed it when they delivered my request and then they decided to give me an extra one. That. Cool, what shade is that? Misbehaving. This one is in the shade Echo Park. Very light peachy. If my lip is not, if my lip has, doesn't have a hyperpigmentation, probably it will work on me because it's a pretty, pretty, pretty color. Oh, that looks kind of, I do they look similar? Don't know. Looks like to me in the shade magic one. So that's gonna go. So this one is, it is from a collaboration. I don't know whose collaboration they make it with, but this is in the shade Secreto. It is my favorite, my most favorite of all this. Colourpop Lippy He is my most favourite I have a backup of this I wore this Two weeks straight when I was in holiday Like I bought I, I brought like six lipstick And this is the only shade I wore for two weeks straight And I love it so much So that's a keep This one is in the shade Softy And it's a keep I guess yeah, it's a keep. It's a nice. Oh, well, the, am I, why am I putting it? <laughs> why am I putting it on my giveaway box? No, no way. That is looking like a rosy, dark rose. Is this one is in a 951. I think this 951 is the kind of shade that I could. That is the, the the nudist that my lips or my shade could go. They look so pretty much the same. But this one I can pull this off. But this two, it just leave me a white cast. This one I had never been open. First watch for you youngs. Oh, that's a pretty, pretty red. Wow, is it an orange red? Yeah, looks like on the camera. Oh gosh, that one drop is a key. It's okay, I'm gonna get it later. This one is oh, I didn't told you what's the shape. Lucky Star, this is a collaboration with Kathleen Lights. What formula are this? It does not say so. But it's a liquid lipstick. This one is from her collaboration to its a uh, lip gloss. And it's a brownie nude lip gloss in the shade Stilo. Oh no. No, no, no. It's a collaboration with Hilary Color Pop. Ha ha. There's the name. I'm lying. That's a key. Um, this one. In the shade YID, YWYD, I don't know. Oof, that's a keep. That's a pretty shade on there. Can you see that? <laughs> you can't see. That one is a keep. This one 
is in the shade Take a Pixie. Ah, I like that name. Take a Pixie. Ooh, perfect brown. Beautiful. Keeping. Um, yeah, that's a keep. Run out of space now, guys. So I need to remove this. Ha! Huh. Look how dirty this one. Give me a sec. Could probably get something better, but. Anyways, it turns my hands red. Wow. The show must go on. <laughs> this one is. um. Lip gloss again in the shade Night Light collaboration again with my favorite beautiful Kathleen Lights. What a pretty shade. Sorry for my stupid swatches. Kathleen Lights again in the shade Etoile. Etoile? I don't know how to pronounce it. They like to make some of the names so difficult for us to read and pronounce. Nice move. This one is in the same fudge. Oh my god, that color is so pretty for a liquid lipstick. But it's a lip gloss. It's a collaboration with Garucci in the shade fudge. D. Fudged with an apostrophe and a D on the end. It's a nice brown. Am I showing it to you properly? I hate the applicator, if you can see. I hate that. It's a keep. Still. Oh, did you switch it to me? It's a lighter pink. I like this one. I like this one. This one is a... Eh. It was like... I've never worn this liquid. This... What do you call it? This... Lip gloss yet, so I could not tell, but I think I like this too. This one is in the shade, it's collaboration again with Captain Lights, Little Star. It's a pretty maroony, browny red. <sighs> I had no idea, it's my first swatch, I've never worn it yet because it's fairly new to me. This one, they said it's a dupe on the Fenty Beauty lip gloss I don't know I don't have Fenty Beauty lip gloss yet but we shall see in the shade Paper Moon what so that's the swatches those are keeps anyway okay just one sec ah oh, my hands is dying oh one second guys Alrighty, ho! Oh. So these are all keeps. Did we declutter anything? <gasps> yeah, we did. We decluttered these three from this. Okay. So far, this is all we have decluttered. Right, okay, this one again. Oh, this is already a keep, right? So, on this side, this is like my most worn use shade. So, let's still go through this. Ginger Bomb. I already swatched that one. Oh, this one is my favorite. Well, up to Choco. It's a very, very beautiful one. As you can see. Ah, oh, it really complements my skin. It's a keep. This one is in the shade. This Maybelline one, oh my god, this, if this is on a high-end packaging, I'll definitely, definitely gonna buy this, and I wouldn't even know if it's a drugstore. 
because with all the lipstick that I had, this is the most long lasting. No matter what you eat, oily, greasy, anything, this will last you for a day and two, for a day or two if you don't remove it. It is such a beautiful formula, long lasting, and beautiful color range. I totally recommend. Gosh, so pretty. This is definitely the lipstick, the liquid lipstick in my collection that I am going to rep keep on repurchasing until they decided to discontinue it. And I hope they won't because it's a good, good, good product. This one is in the shade Self Starter. It's fairly new in my collection, but I like the color. This one is a staple Amazonian number 70. I guess it's everyone's favorite. I'm a brownie girl. That color is a favorite of mine. Beautiful. Definitely need to get a new one next year. This one is Fighter number 75. Oh, I've seen a new shade. It's called Globe Trotter. I need to get that one. This is in the shade Amazonian, as I've said before. It is a Pretty shade. I have worn this a gazillion times. This one is from Fudge. From Fudge, you know, it's from Makeup Revolution, collaboration with Self Death Nail and the shade Fudge. It's pretty, as you can see. But I've never worn it that much to appreciate the beauty of it. But that's a key. This is from Makeup Revolution again. I feel like it reminds me of Charlotte Tilbury's packaging. That is in the shade. What shade is that? Are you giving up on me? That is in the shade. Oh no, sorry about that. Wow. I could not wear it on its own. But with my magic combinator, combina combination shade, this works. This is very pretty. Where was it? Let me get my perfect combination. Oh, no, that's not the one. This is from a local brand in my country in the Philippines. From Everblana and the shade Shenas. Oh my god, this is the only lipstick that looks like this in my whole collection. Because because this with this three nudie with this combination is a heaven uh, I'm gonna give you a swatch it looks like a ready thing ready, ready pink orangey eye coral I don't know I'll explain it thoroughly it's a cute when I get a chance but this three are keeping the first one I swatched that's a vow this one is in breath can you see it I had worn this a couple of times so I know it works and I like how it looks in my lips so it's a okay cute you guys it's in the shade class very pretty keep and this one is my favorite, my all-time favorite. As per this tree right here. This is from a local brand again in my country. It's in the shade Champagne Nude from Nichido. So pretty. I could literally pull that nude off. So I got compliments of that. Many compliments. Shockingly. Plenty of compliments. Oh, my hands is aching. <laughs> ah, this one is from Kiko. Wow, that is pretty. I know I like that. That's so cute. Now I don't know how do they stuck together before. I think. Do you like that? There you go. One drop is a key. It's okay. I'm gonna get it later. 
This one is oh I didn't told you what's the shape. Lucky star. This is a collaboration with Kathleen Lights. What formula are this? It does not say so. But it's a liquid lipstick. This one is from her collaboration to its a uh, lip gloss. And it's a brownie nude lip gloss in the shade Stilo. Oh no. No, no, no. It's a collaboration with Hilary. Color Pop. Haha. <laughs> There's the name. I'm lying. That's a key. Um, this one. In the shade YID. Y W Y D. I don't know. Oof. That's a key. That's a pretty shade down there. Can you see that? <laughs> you can't see. That one is a kit. This one is in the shade. Take a pixie. Ah, I like that name. Take a pixie. Ooh, perfect brand. Beautiful. Keeping. Um, yeah, that's a keep. Run out of space now, guys. I need to remove this. Ha! Huh. Look how dirty this one. Just give me a sec. Could probably get something better, but. Anyways, it turns my hands red. Ah, the show must go on. This one is, um,. Lip gloss again in the shade Night Light collaboration again with my favorite beautiful Kathleen Lights. What a pretty shade. Sorry for my stupid swatches. Kathleen Lights again in the shade Etoile. Etoile? I don't know how to pronounce it. They like to make some of the names so difficult for us to read and pronounce. Nice move. This one is in the same fudge. Oh my god, that color is so pretty for a liquid lipstick. But it's a lip gloss. It's a collaboration with Garucci in the shade fudge. D. Fudged with an apostrophe and a D on the end. It's a nice brown. Am I showing it to you properly? I hate the applicator, if you can see. I hate that. It's a keep. Still. Oh, did you switch it totally here? Yeah. It's a lighter pink. I like this one. I like this one. This one is a... Eh. It was like... I've never worn this liquid. This. What do you call it? This. Lip gloss yet, so I could not tell, but I think I like this too. This one is in the shade, it's collaboration again with Captain Lights, Little Star. It's a pretty maroony, browny red. <sighs> I had no idea, it's my first swatch, I've never worn it yet because it's fairly new to me. This one, they said it's a dupe on the Fenty Beauty lip gloss. I don't know. I don't have Fenty Beauty lip gloss yet. But we shall see in the shade Paper Moon. Right, so that's the swatches. Those are keeps anyway. Okay, just one sec. Ah, oh, my hands is dying. Oh, one second guys. Alrighty, ho! Oh. So these are all keeps. Did we declutter anything? <gasps> yeah, we did. We decluttered 
these three. Um, this. Okay. So far, this is all we have decluttered. Right, okay, this one again. Oh, this is already a cute, right? So, on this side, this is like my most worn used shade. So, let's still go through this. Ginger Balm. I already swatched that one. Oh, this one is my favorite. Well, up to Choco. It's a very, very beautiful one. As you can see. Ah, oh, it really complements my skin. It's a keep. This one is in the shade. This Maybelline one. Oh my god. This, if this is on a high-end packaging, I'm definitely, definitely going to buy this. And I wouldn't even know if it's a drugstore. Because with all the lipstick that I had, this is the most long-lasting. No matter what you eat, oily, greasy, anything this will last you for a day and two for a day or two if you don't remove it it is such a beautiful formula long lasting and beautiful color range i totally recommend gosh so pretty this is definitely the lipstick the liquid lipstick in my collection that i am going to re keep on repurchasing until they decided to Discontinue it and I hope they won't because it's a good 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 product. This one is in the shade self starter It's fairly new in my collection, but I like the color This one is a staple Amazonia number 70 I guess it's everyone's favorite. I'm a brownie girl That color is a favorite of mine Beautiful Definitely need to get a new one next year this one is Fighter number 75. Oh, I've seen a new shade. It's called Globe Trotter. I need to get that one. This is in the shade Amazonian, as I've said before. It is a pretty shade. I have worn this a gazillion times. This one is from Fudge. From Fudge, no, it's from. Makeup Revolution, collaboration with Soft Dust Nail and the shade Fudge. It's pretty, as you can see. But, I've never worn it that much to appreciate the beauty of it. But that's a key. This is from Makeup Revolution again. I feel like it reminds me of Charlotte Tilbury's packaging. That is in the shade. What shade is that? Are you giving up on me? That is in the shade. <gasps> oh no, sorry about that. Wow. I could not wear it on its own. But with my magic combinator, combina combination shade, this works. This is very pretty. Where was it? Let me get my perfect combination. No, that's not the one. This is from a local brand in my country in the Philippines from Everblana and the shade Shenas. Oh my god, this is the only lipstick that looks like this in my whole collection. Because, because this with this three nudie with this combination is a heaven. Uh I'm gonna give you a swatch. It looks like a ready thing, ready, ready pink, orangey eye coral. I don't know. I'll explain it thoroughly. It's a keep. Then I get a chance. But these three are keeping. The first one I swatched, that's a vow. This one is in breath. Can you see it? I had worn this a couple of times, so I know it works. And I like how it looks in my lips, so it's okay with you guys. It's in the shade class. Very pretty. Keep and 
this one is my favorite my all time favorite as per this tree right here this is from a local brand again in my country it's in the shade champagne nude from Nichido so pretty I could literally pull that nude off so I got compliments of that many compliments shockingly plenty of compliments oh, my hands is aching <laughs> uh, this one is from Kiko oh, wow that is pretty I know I like that that's a kid now I don't know how do they stuck together before I think they were like that. There you go. 